Hey guys, this is XX Reviews 101 XX, and I promised you a video. If you follow me on Twitter, um, I've been saying I would post a new video, and this video is going to be very short and brief. The main apps that oh, this video is going to be mostly about the main apps you must have. I mean, like are like the best apps, one of the best at least you must have on an Android system phone. First, I'm gonna start with backgrounds. Well, and before that, plug in my charger. Plug in my little charger. Okay, that's better. That's where I'm dying. Okay, well, let's start with backgrounds. Like I said, I won't be going to all the apps. What, what you can do mainly with backgrounds is the new pictures. Let's get this one right here. A little hard on it. And set it as your background. Right here, there's this is an up set up saying um set wallpaper. Set that as wallpaper. Let me see. Set as wallpaper. And this is um hold on a sec. And it says your uh new wallpaper has been set. And the cool thing is it saves the image too. Okay, right here. So my so my wallpaper. And next app is um, Google Sky Maps. Sky Maps. If you're really if you're really into astronomy, the stars, this is a really good map. This is a really good application for you. It's all motion censored. So let's say I gotta, gotta open it right here. Right, and all I do is go like that. Like, oh, it, it's really good if you point up in the sky. And you start like moving it, shows all the constellations, and you have some um, options here like search, toggle, night mode, settings, and about. But I'm not gonna get into that right now. Um, let's let's see the other app. Another big app you if you're into messaging like AIM, MSN, Yahoo, Facebook, Messenger thing. You should have you should have um eBuddy. Yeah, okay. My username when you um uh, on the oh god. Okay. I'll log in, whatever. When you log in shows all your friends. So here you could like type in like stuff and press send. And um it's pretty much like a chat box. Really good. The good thing about eBuddy is um uh the good thing about eBuddy is that you don't you, you don't need to like install like AIM, MSN, uh a Facebook Messenger. What you can mainly do is just install eBuddy and you have those all in one, which really helps. And another huge app that every Android phone ex especially the Droid with its extremely small like battery life is the advanced task killer right here right see all the tasks i'm running right now applications yeah th those are all running and it's not, it's not like the iphone to where like you go nap you press the home button and it cancels that cancels that app on the droid even though you go back home it's like you're still using that application so what i do every time i get all like let's say I'm, i've been using like a um, browser some widgets like some applications every time i, g I get out of those i always hit kill selected apps it cancels out, like all the apps and saves you a ton of battery life especially when you boot up and there's all these processes running because um you boot up your phone i do that every time i boot up my phone and after i get a bunch of applications okay what's next over that over that oh another application if you like to edit photos is called pixay Let's get a picture. I'm gonna get a random pick. Whatever, like this. Here's a little Android logo. Let's go here. Hit the menu button. There's called Word Balloons, ABC Props, Effects, and Export. You hit more. Transform object. But let's just hit um props. Um, 
things for signs and symbols. Let's put thunder like right there. Let's say you want, it's too big, you want to edit it. It's not a problem. Go like that. Up. And move it right there. Whoa, best, best picture. And you could do much more like word balloons, ABC titles, uh, and effects, and props. We just d did that. So, I'm sorry guys, I have to go fast. I, I, it's been, right now, it's been 5 minutes and 35 seconds. So, okay. Next is Google Voice. is a must-have app. It's, I mean, it's still a really helpful um, app. If you really don't like using your minutes, and if you go to Google.com, you can actually like um, buy their service, and you can use Google Voice to talk instead of actually paying for minutes. Using Google Voice is a lot cheaper than actually paying your your comp uh, like an example like paying Verizon for minutes. So it's a really good app. Can't go over that right now on a time limit. Uh, let's see. Oh. An app I use a lot, a lot, especially in class, when I'm like doing like quiz or something. It's called Talk to Me. It translates something from English to let's say I think Italian class. Um, like I put something in um, English that he that he says, and and like let's say he says like oh put it into say like write it down in Italian. I put it in English, but translate and it shows it in Italian. So I mean, like you can you can even choose your language here, a couple languages: German, Italian, English, UK, English, United States, Spanish, French. I mean, yeah. And see if I got over them, most of them. Check. Um, yeah. The last app is mostly for entertainment. It's called Android Lightsaber. You hit here. You hear your little music here? Right. And then you hit your lightsaber. I go do it like that. Mostly for entertainment. <laughs> I really like that. And you hit like the little picture icon, you could change who you want to like who you want to be. Um Sentinel Jedi, Mace Windu, Master Yoda, Luke Skywalker, and Darth Vader. Has new characters coming soon. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so that was mainly it, guys. Um, stay tuned for my next videos. Like, follow me on Twitter. I I post every time when I'm gonna put like um I post on Twitter. Whenever I'm gonna make a video, if you follow me, you know that. So thanks for watching this video, and hope I hope to see you in my next videos.